Hi, my name is Keith Taylor. I am a pre-sales core security engineer within the Southeast region. Today I'd like to talk to you about regex filtering within the smart connector or using ArcMC itself. I'll be using ArcMC version 2.9. Um, a reason that you may want to get rid of these logs is that this is legitimate traffic and you don't and it's not supporting a use case. So that can take up 40% of your traffic and that's something you can be using for another use case or bringing in another log source. So I had a client come to me uh, saying, hey, I have this log source and it's a Palo Alto firewall and it's going to a legitimate IP address of .45. So what I would like to do is, is uh, stop seeing that traffic within ArcSight. I had asked him to send me over a raw log from the logger of the traffic so I can create a regular expression to um, uh, filter it out. So he sent me the logs and within the logs, you can see the destination of dot 45. So, and I created a regular expression of backslash W destination with the IP address. Yes, there's many ways of doing this. This is uh, one way that we can do this one specific IP address. I'm going to copy that IP address and I wanna to go to ArcMC. And under configuration management, I wanna to go to bulk operations. And within bulk operations, go to container. And then under container, go to the container that this Palo Alto or syslog you have to do this for each individual container that sees the, that type of uh, traffic. So I'm gonna go here and hit properties. I wanna search and if I've just put in CUS, it comes up with what I'm looking for, which is custom event filter regex enable. I wanna hit edit and true and paste the regular expression and click on save. And while it's loading, it is actually loading this onto the container itself. And then it says success. And now when you go back to the logger, you will not see that traffic uh, from the Pacific source IP address or source to the destination of .45. Thank you much and have a wonderful day.